With Pop Warner World, I just use cyan, magenta, and yellow and mix them together. And so like the, the bright green poplin is like solid yellow, little blue dots on top of that that turn green when they mix with the yellow. Gotcha. And that's how it gets, and if you step back and look at it, it looks like bright green. So, and that's, interesting. so that's all, I, I only use those three colors plus black. That's really interesting. I did yeah. not know that. Yeah. So you can, I can, every one of my pieces is basically four layers. Yeah. So what, what was the inspiration for doing that like three color stuff in general? It's just because that's how they used to print those comic books. Oh, okay. And so I, I, I do, I, I basically, my style is like recreating that. So if you look closely, <clears throat> it's, it's the same way that they, you know, did Sunday comics and comic books, except for I, I, I blow the dots up like quite a bit more than they would be like in a comic book because in a comic book they're there as like a illusion to mm -hmm. trick your eye and it kind of works the same way but I wanted the dots to be a little bit more apparent but um, but yeah so I, I do that and then I distress the pieces as well and mess them up <clears throat> and I go in a lot of the, it's not every single piece but a lot of them if you zoom in and look I, I went through and erased the, the middle of every line that I drew just faintly because when you when you printed that thing back in the day it would like all the ink would go to the edges and it would like leave a little hmm. you know so like I, I I spent like a lot of hours looking at stuff online in real life I have matchbook collections so I'm looking at the matchbooks like really closely I'm like oh yeah like right at the edge is there's just this little faint line around everything and I redo that in there and then I have I took like splattering ink on like paper and I scuffing up paper and crumpling it up, scanning it, um, doing all that. And I made my own brushes and I use some other stuff that, that I bought, but I go through and if you look closely on most of them, you'll see little ink splatters and little scuffs. I'll scuff up like each layer of color. I'll scuff up the, the, uh, the line work and I'll even like blur the dot like the dots a little bit because when those dots hit that paper they wouldn't just sit there it would, it would spread out a tiny mm -hmm. little bit and kind of like feather out the edges a little bit